Hi Foxy friends, this is Sarah from Foxy's Domestic Side and today I have my very first Erin Condren review. I've heard so many good things about this and I'm so excited that I actually won a giveaway back in March and I saved it so that I could buy a new Erin Condren for the 2018 year. I'm going to do an unbox. I have not opened it yet so I do not know what it looks like. I'm so excited to do this review for you. So let's get started. I have opened the box but I have not opened it to look. I did take the tape off but I did not open the box so I do not know what's in this. Let's get started. All right, right off there's some cheers. Please fill slowly. Welcome and enjoy these free gifts. Oh, that's cool. These are stickers, labels. So it says cheers to from. That's really cute. And here's another little one right here. Wisdom begins with wonder. Um, oh, it's just a postcard. That's cute. It's just a postcard here, so that's really cute. All right, I'm so excited. I have not opened this. I, have n I do not know what it looks like. Enjoy, I will. All right, wrapped really nicely. Oh, here's, oh, I did add some snap bookmarks, snap in bookmarks, because I thought would be helpful to find my place where I am in my um, planner. All right, so excited. So here it is. I did decide that I wanted to use this planner for my blog. Um, I did want to use this for the blog, so I had my name put here and Foxy's domestic side put right, put right there. And this is, I guess, a little ruler or a bookmark slash ruler. So I really like that when it comes in. It. Um, oh, and I like this is a whiteboard right here. Maybe I should have bought the markers. Maybe I'll go back and do that. Um, here is a zipper pouch. I guess it just stays in there. There's no way to connect it. So our gift to you, enjoy these samples for yourself and a gift to a friend. Let's see what's in it. Oh, these are just cards with sayings on them. Oh, here's a, another ruler, so that's nice. I can never have too many of those. And hello friend, what is this? Oh, this is a uh, coupon. So if you want the code, let me know and I will send you the code uh, for 20% off. So it looks like I can only give it to two people. So the first two people to um, say I want it, I will send it to you. And then these are happy birthday stickers. Oh, that's cute. So two more stickers that I got for free. Okay, so I'm so excited to open this planner. Let's see what this planner has. Let's zoom me in a bit. Life on the go, this is my life. Oh, this is like a thick paper, so that's nice being on the cover so it doesn't rip the first pages up here. And this binding is so gorgeous, this rose gold. Um, I did pay extra for this rose gold because I thought it was really pretty. Um, I don't know, can you see this? How pretty this is? Gorgeous, right? I thought it went nice with the flamingos. Okay, so so July 2017 to December 2018 looks like it's just kind of a calendar at a glance, which is really nice when you're you know trying to figure out dates with friends and you can just flip to this front page to figure out the dates. And then I really like having these two-page spreads for calendars, so I knew that I wanted that. Um, I have had that on all of my previous um, day planners going back 20 years. Um, I like that there's no lines because I don't like to write in the lines. I like to just be able to do what I want to do. So this is January. I'll flip through these real quick. February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December, and then, oh, a notes section. So this is gonna be, oh. Okay, so you're discovering this with me. Um, oh, okay, so this is what, 
Okay, now I remember what I ordered. I ordered this a while ago and it's taken me a while to do this unboxing. So January, so in my other day planner, it has, uh, let me go get it. So this is currently my day planner that I use right now. It is from Franklin Covey. Um, it has the, you can see the size difference of it. So this new size is gonna be um, new to get used to because you know, clearly I'm used to carrying this small thing around. I do carry this everywhere I go in case I have a blog idea. So it is quite substantially much bigger. Um, so let's go to January. So in the new, in my old planner, this Franklin planner, you have each month, um, you go through each month, and then I flip to the back, and then there's, in the back section here, is where all of the weekly planning goes for each month. So it's kind of set up the same way, um, as far as Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, um, kind of set up the same way. But I do like this, that it's in the actual month that you're in, instead of being at the back of the planner like this one is. I do like that this is in the month that it is, instead of having to flip to the back, back here. So I do really like that. It makes it more convenient. You don't have to flip this whole book to get you know, when you're in January or February, one of the beginning months, you don't have to flip through the whole book to get to the note sections for that day. It makes more sense to be in the month that it is. So I really, really like that. Um, so that's that. So each, it looks like each week's will be four pages. And I really, really like this. I'm super excited. I'm glad that I decided to use this planner for the blog for my blog. So I have two planners, one for the blog and one for life in general, <laughs> for meetings and stuff. Um, so and I like that there's kind of, I can write goals over here if I want to. And then each page has a you are a diamond, nothing can break you. There's a notes section back here. So that's nice when I want to write notes about, you know, things, if I've taken a class on blogging or something, I can take some, a few notes here. I like to keep my Pinterest, some Pinterest information here about like, how big Pinterest images are, what colors to use, stuff like that. Just like some quick um, go-to notes. And then there's some blank pages in the back, some coloring pages, I guess. And then, oh, maybe this is like a quick look. Maybe you can write, there's four of them, so maybe um, something that's happening in each week that you want to maybe um, highlight each week. So that's kind of cool. Oh, and then there's a whole bunch of stickers. I don't know if I'm going to be using this, you know, how a lot of people use it. I really just think I'm going to be using it to write information down. I don't think I'm going to be able to decorate it each week, but it is nice that these stickers come with it. I might actually use these stickers in my other planner that I have, which I am going to do a full review on um, in the coming weeks. So stay tuned for that. Oh, and I like that there's a pocket back here. If there's like, maybe I can hold some business cards in there or something. Oh, what's it? Celebrate someone or something every day. Perpetual contacts. Oh, so this is just, oh, to write birthdays and such down. That's kind of cool. I probably won't use it for my blog planner unless I want to write blog friends' birthdays. That would be kind of nice to start writing down, you know, those blogs that you follow regularly. And I do like that there's this whiteboard here. I do remember seeing that you could buy some markers that were more permanent and you actually had to do something else to wipe it off and it just doesn't wipe off like really easily. So you write long-term goals here or something. So I might end up going to get those, we'll see. So far I am really liking this. You know what I think I'm gonna do? I think I'm going to do maybe like a mid-year review on how I like the Erin Condren planner because this is the first time I've used it. I have used Franklin Covey planners for the past 20 plus years. So this is a huge step for me to go to something else. I did buy a Franklin planner for like life stuff with my family. Um, I am gonna review that as well, but this is my first, you know, reveal unboxing of this. And I think I might do a couple videos on how I organize. All right, so that is my Erin Condren review. So my final review on the Erin Condren. I think it's kind of big, so I am a little, scared to go through this year carrying this big thing around. This is going to be my blogging calendar um, where I put all my, you know, posts and what I'm going to do and my collabs and stuff. So 
so I am a little nervous about that. But other than that, I think the cover is gorgeous. I love it. These little flamingos. And then I love that you can personalize it. Um, so those were two things that I thought were really cool. Um, and I do like that the months to write your notes are right after the month that it happens. So I don't have to go, like my other planner, I have to go to the back to get to the days of the uh, month. So I do like that. So far I think the quality, the quality is really great. Um, the pages are thick, the, you know, this front cover is thick so it's going to be durable. So, you know, I know I can just throw it in my purse and it'll be okay. And I did get a few extra um, page holders. So I think that's going to help out in the long run, but we'll see. I'm going to come back in maybe a couple, a few months to give you an update on what I think about this. But so far, so good. I really like it. And the only concern I have about it is how big it is and kind of how expensive it is. It is really expensive and I don't know if I'm going to be, I don't think I'm going to use it how everyone else uses it as for a scrapbooking and stuff, but we'll see how it goes and uh, I'll let you know. So uh, thanks for watching and I'll, don't forget to check out my review that's going to come out next week, I believe, on my other day planner. So I bought two day planners and my other day planner, which is actually a Franklin Covey, like the very first planner. And I will have that up to you next week. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye.